Hey, what's up, everybody? Ray Jr. coming with Fanatics. I hope everybody's having a great and wonderful, what is this, Wednesday? Wednesday evening. Well, Wednesday night, excuse me. Uh, big shout out to all the YouTube channels out there and all the Facebook pages. Uh, the video you're about to see is another CGC haul I just got in today. So, uh, without further delay, I'll go ahead and tell you, show you what I got. Uh, right here, I got Power Girl number two from her... Uh, Four issue limited series from 1988. Uh, let me tell you a little something about this book. Uh, I already have one that I had in my personal collection, which was a 7.0. Sent it in, got it pressed, and it's still well. It came back 7.0 even without even with being pressed. So I go on Mile High Comics and see that they had one, a raw copy near mint. So I go ahead and pick it up, and thinking, okay, it's near mint. So I sent it in to get graded, and that's the grade I get. So I messaged them, uh, told them how I felt, told them they'll never get my business again because of the fact that you advertise this book as near mint, and it comes back at 8.5. So I know I talked to uh, TiVo. He told me I should have had it pressed, but like I said, uh, I was under the assumption that it was a near mint book. It didn't need to be pressed. It looked pretty pretty good anyway when I got it and looked at it and looked like a near mint but I guess not so I don't know maybe when I get back from the deployment I might uh, send it in get it pressed and then see what it does see if it bumps it up but uh yeah I was a little bit uh, upset with that so uh, they got my message because I sent it on Facebook so I know they seen it because when you send it you know when you send that message on messenger it shows when they pop down and somebody viewed it, so, but they have not responded. This was a uh, uh, couple of days, well, it was last week when I'm, I want to say when I messaged them because uh, this went through my account, so I was able to view the grade. But anyway, moving right along. Next up is Journey to Mystery 88. Yep, 88 4.0. This is the second appearance of Loki. Pretty nice book. Uh, this book... I bought October of 2016. It was a CBCS book and it was a 3.5. So that one didn't get pressed either. So I sent it in and it came back a 4.0. So I got two more books to show that there were CBCS and it seems like their grades are kind of close. So, um, so I wasn't too uh, upset about that. I was kind of glad it, it went up a 4.0. So uh, I, I was pretty stoked on that. Next up, we have The Marvel Family, number 10. 5.0, Golden Age book. Real nice cover right there. The, this one right here. Um, I had all the greater notes from uh, CBCS. Cause like I said, that was, I bought this book raw. Uh, I want to say 2015. Sent it in to CBCS. That's when I was going to you know, gave them a try or whatever, and it came back a 5.5, so now fast forward to 2018, and I was like, okay, I want all my books to match, so I'm going to make sure all my books are CGC, so I sent it in, uh, I want to say they received it in January, January 3rd, but since it was old, these are older books, so they went under the value tier, so it took a little bit longer to get graded. So came back a 5.0, and I'm very happy with that. And um, I think it looks a whole lot better in the, the CGC case than the, the CBCS. No offense to my CBCS uh, brothers and sisters out there that use CBCS. It's just everybody has a preference. All right, last but not least is Captain and the Marvel Captain Marvel Adventures number 47, 3.5. You go right there, him and the wizard Shazam. Pretty nice cover right there. Okay, like I said, this one was a CBCS book as well. This one was a 4.0. Sorry about the, let's see, there's a glare right there. So, all right, we'll just do that. Okay, um, it was a 4.0, came back at 3.5. So, like I said, their grades. Or within 0.5, so wasn't tripping too much. Um, so I was I was pretty 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 satisfied with the grade, but like I said, um, 
within the grading companies, you can see the, you know, the, they're, they're kind of close. So to all you CBCS uh, users out there and the CGC users, is, you know, um, it seems like, you know, they're pretty dead on uh, with their grades or whatever within uh, being the 0.5. Uh, so um, that's all I got to say on that one. But I hope you uh, like this video. Like I said, there's a couple of Golden Age books, a Silver Age book, and a, pretty much a Bronze Age, kind of modern because 1988 book. So hopefully it was a little bit different books instead of you seeing uh, uh, Thor. Uh, I know some of y'all probably be like, oh, probably about time or whatever. But of course, Thor is my, Thor is my books right there. So I'll never stop getting those, uh, sending them in, get graded or getting a signed one. So till next time, I uh, hope everybody has a great and wonderful Monday. Why am I saying Monday? Uh, Wednesday night. Um, so go ahead and uh, comment, uh, click like, uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And until next time, I'm out.